A miniature tubular cordial ice block. Delicious. And you can make one in just a few minutes in the kitchen. Here's what you do. And although you won't need a refrigerator, you will need to have some ice cubes or some crushed ice. You might say, won't I need a refrigerator to make those? Perhaps you will. You'll also need a salt shaker with salt in it, an empty glass, a glass of cordial, a plastic drinking straw and a rubber band. Now the first thing you need to do is to make your freezing mixture. Here's how you do it. Take the ice, or some of the ice, and put it in the empty glass. A layer of ice, or a few centimetres thick, then sprinkle salt liberally over the ice. Several good shakes like that. Then more ice, a few more centimetres, more salt. And keep doing that, ice and salt, ice and salt, ice and salt, until you're almost up to the top of the glass. Now what you've done here is to make a mixture which will actually take the temperature of things down lower than the temperature which you find with normal ice by itself. There we are, and we're nearly ready to start. Believe it or not, that's just like a little refrigerator. Now to set up the tubular ice block, we need cordial in the drinking straw. Put it into the cordial, put your finger over the end of the straw, and lift the straw out. Cordial stays there. If you take your finger off the end of the straw at this point, cordial falls out. So do that again. Keep your finger right over the end of the straw until you pinch the other end. Now we've trapped the cordial in there. Now we need to push the cordial up a little way so that we can then fold the end of the drinking straw over. This is where the rubber band comes in. Using that rubber band, we'll now trap the cordial in that little pocket. By putting the rubber band around the folded drinking straw like that, stretching it tight, putting it around a second time, and a third time, and a fourth time, and as many times as you need, until the rubber band secures the end of the drinking straw and you're sure that the cordial won't come out. I think one more time and we'll be there. One more time, twist it over, there we are. We have a secure little pocket of cordial there. All we need to do is to freeze that. And to do that, it goes into our mini refrigerator. I'll push it down among the ice and salt and then use the straw as a stirrer and stir it around and around and around. Now because of the very low temperature of that ice and salt mixture, what's happening already is the temperature of cordial in the drinking straw is getting lower and lower, lower and lower, and eventually it should freeze. Right, it's been stirring for about two or three minutes now, and I think it's almost ready. Now you can check to see if it's ready by taking it out of the ice mixture and press and if you can feel that the cordial has gone hard you know that you've made an ice block then you start squeezing it from the bottom just like squeezing toothpaste out of a tube and keep squeezing it all the way and push it up towards the open end of the straw and before very long you'll be ready to sample that delight that you've been waiting for the incredible tubular ice block they don't last long, but they taste delicious. I want to know.